All right, time now is 8.35. There are over a thousand cars on display this morning to check out from Italian exotics to American muscle and free coffee and donuts. That's where you got me. Todd Walker joins us from Cars and Coffee with more details. Good morning, Todd. Good morning, Leah. Good morning, Cody. I am right now on the deck. It's about a 400 square foot deck on one of the car condos. And I thought we'd give you another view of what these places look like. Check this out. So this is the upper level of the garage. We have a full bathroom. We have a kitchen. We have this full living area. And of course, the flat screen TV and the fireplace. And I'm here with Tom. Good morning, Tom. Good morning. All right. So Tom, uh, how long do you have this place? I've had it for about two years. Two years. Okay. So you did you come into this and redo the upper level here? Yeah, I redid the, the upper level. You know, basically all the furniture and everything in here repainted and and added some different things up here. So right. how often do you come out here? I come out here a lot more than my wife would prefer. <laughs> okay. Well, uh, three three four times a week typically. All right. So let's check out the other side here. So. Leah, Cody, I want to show you, I thought we just would go out on a little bit on the veranda. So now I'm on the balcony above Tom's uh, car condo, and you can check out some of his cars down here. So tell us a little bit about your car collection. Okay, I have, uh, my, my goal is to kind of get one car from each decade. So currently I have a 57 Chevy, I have a 1991 ZR1 Corvette, I have an 81 Trans Am turbo car, I have a 71 Chevelle 454, 4-speed, uh, and then I got an 08 uh, Z51 Corvette. All right, so what's your next addition to the collection? Oh, I'm currently dealing on a 64 Corvette right now, so. All right, so about 1,000 cars, about 5,000 people minimum come out here the first Saturday of every month, completely free. Gives people that have not had a chance to come out here an idea what type of cars they're going to see when they stop in. Okay, there's, it's really kind of a unique show. It's one of the largest shows in Minnesota, private shows, and you can see anything from a rat rod, basically, to high-end Mercedes, Ferraris, um, McLarens. So it's really a big variety. Packards, I got a Packard from a friend that's in front of my garage, so it's really a big variety of different cars. All right, and how many condos are there out here? I believe there's 140 condos out here. 140 condos, plus Leah, Cody, they have a clubhouse that I checked out a little bit earlier, so that's where you guys all go and hang out. Yeah, we also have a car wash that we can use so we can wash our own cars and stuff out here as well, so. Do you actually work on your cars? Yeah, I personally work on my cars. A lot of people don't, but I have a lift in my garage, as you can see, and I do a lot of work on my own cars. So. All right, it's fascinating. It's absolutely unbelievable. And if people start lining up, Leah, Cody, I got here at 6.30 this morning, a little bit before 6.30, and there was already a line all the way out to the freeway. Yeah, so I, I usually come at 6 o'clock, and there's cars lined up at the gate when I get here. You know, and, and I can get through the gate, of course, if, if they get it grouped, but uh, we figure there's somewhere around $200 million worth of cars on the lot. On this. <sighs> Unbelievable. Tom, thanks for joining us this morning. Leah, Cody, we're showing you about 1% of what you can see when you come out here for cars and coffee. And just so you guys know, uh, the one that we're in right now, if you're interested, it's about half a million dollars, uh, and you can have a, a wonderful garage for your cars. So what do you think, Leah, Cody? Should I put down a purchase agreement for you guys? Uh, sure, if you want to just give me $500,000. <laughs> I just bought a house earlier this year. I'm going to pass on this one. <laughs>